just kidding. I'm going to go up to my hotel room, play a little game I like to call Try Not to Masturbate. Now, I'm not very good at it. Matt Zero, Internet 27,816. But you got to play to win, right? You cannot be a passenger in this life. You have to apply yourself if you want to be somebody. And I don't even like internet porn, okay? Don't let my browser history fool you. I think it's disgusting. <laughs> Mostly because all the negativity on the internet. I'll find something as beautiful and poetic as pornography. And then underneath in the comment section, all the haters set in. Like Jeff Horny Dildo, Bong Water 37. I'll be like, this porno actress isn't cute anymore. <laughs> or people give a thumbs down to the porn video. Anytime you're on YouPorn, you see a rating that's less than 100%. That means someone took time out of their jerk to be like, I don't like it. Which poses the question, what exactly are you impressed with? Because there are beautiful people butt naked on your computer for free, and you're like, not good enough for me. Not up to my high standards. If you got something better to watch, click on it. Otherwise, leave these nice people alone. They're sacrificing their health and their future so you can have more fun when you're lonely. That doesn't mean anything to you. Have fun in hell, because that's exactly where you're headed. Amen. Judge not, lest ye be judged yourself. There you go. You don't have to go to church tomorrow morning. You got the sermon of your life on Saturday night. You're welcome. Sleep in on me, bitches. What? I feel like I'm giving like a, a TED Talk in hell or something. To all the single people out there, wear a condom if you can. I know none of you will. I feel like condoms were just a fad in the 90s that never really caught on. When I was single, women used to encourage me not to use a condom, which I think is crazy. If the roles are reversed and there's a chance I could grow a person in my stomach and then have to piss them out my dick hole and raise them for 20 years and pay for everything, I'd be like, dude, put on three. Are you kidding me? Like, what is the downside here? Well, it doesn't feel as good with a condom. As if squeezing out an eight pound human bowling ball out of your urethra is some kind of summer music festival? Come on. And I know babies don't come out of your urethra. I'm not stupid. They come out of your butthole. I'm just, I'm just trying to make jokes up here, everybody. That's what the mic is for. All right, you guys are so much fun. Thank you so much for having me.